Coast to Coast Radio with Tony G here, with you all day and all through the night. This is Tony G with Coast to Coast Radio, bringing you the coolest sounds on the airwaves. Keep it right here. You're tuned in to Coast to Coast? I'm Tony G. And if you're looking for the smoothest sounds in town, this is where it's at. Stick around. We're taking listener requests this hour, so call in and tell me what you'd like all our Coast to Coast listeners to hear next. Tony G here, matching mellow tunes and happening vibes. That was a smooth vibe, this week's top pick. You're listening to Tony G, bringing you smooth sounds from coast to coast. Don't touch the dial, just sit back and enjoy. All righty. Tony G, back on the airwaves, cruising through some sweet sounds to get you in the mood. The day's a little gray, so hunker on down, get comfortable, and enjoy some mellow vibes to chase away those blues. Picking back up on this week's Best Grub in Town contest, remember, we're talking burgers, folks. And I mean big, old, juicy, meaty must-haves. Let's hear where you go to chow down. Who has the coolest fixins? Which burger joint serves up those five napkin patties? That juice just trickling down your arm. Mm. Anyone around here getting hungry? <laughs> Call in and tell me where I should be stopping on my way home from work, folks. In the meantime, here's another sweet track to help pass the day. Woo-wee, sports fans! Hope y'all are stoked and ready to make some noise and party tonight! Gearing up for the weekend, folks. Get your tailgate on, eat some food, grab some adult beverages. Always remember to drink responsibly, folks. And enjoy the on-field action. Hut! Hut! Who are you all rooting for? I know I'll be cheering for the home team all the way. Gonna shape up to be a wild ride if those boys can pull it off. There's gonna be some partying. But first, let's chill out with the smoothest tracks in town. Freaky deaky. Yo, folks, like spiders. Man, those things are out there. I mean, who even needs that many legs? How many directions do they need to walk in at once, huh? I guess they have trouble making decisions since they got eight eyes, too. No wonder their webs look like crazy two dimensional knots. They were probably just trying to spin a straight line, but they got all confused following their own directions, like humans assembling furniture. Hope all you listeners out there are kicking back and chilling. Feeling kind of mellow myself today, sipping my matcha latte and dunking my cookie, chocolate chip and CBD. Mm. Let's chase this vibe all the way to the wee hours, folks. Just sit back and let the music flow. Forget those nine to five hassles. Let your to-do list sit a while longer and allow yourself to enjoy the moment. Here's another track to help us slip away from the rat race and find some inner peace. Hi 
listeners, I'm still on the air, I think. Hope I didn't lose anybody during that last track. Hello? Am I alone in here? Whoa. Alone in a dark sound studio. Does that mean the crazy axe murderer is somewhere lurking in the hallways? (laughs) Oh, I guess I'll be fine. As long as a dude named Brad doesn't suddenly show up. Did you ever notice how Brad is always bad luck? It's always, Brad, help me. And like, he never does. Maybe he's the axe murderer's secret wingman. Guess we'll never know. If we're lucky. Coast to Coast Radio, you're just in the right spot with Tony G. Soaking up the atmospherics tonight and getting ourselves in the mood for the con. I know a lot of you listeners will be heading out to check out what's new in the comic and video game world, and I'm planning on indulging in a little cosplay myself, bringing out that inner warrior. Call in and let me know which character you dress as and why. One lucky winner will snag an all-expense-paid trip to the big event, courtesy of Coast to Coast. Great deal, guys. One word of warning, though. It's dangerous to go alone. So take me. Ever get that spooky sense that you can talk another language and you never realized it? Like a deep psychic sense that you've inherited some intuitive knowledge. Shawabup, dizup, right? I mean, what language is that even? Is it ancient Tibetan or Alpha Centurion or what? Somewhere way out in the biosphere, some alien being is like nodding in agreement with me this very instant. And I got no idea what I just said, but they do. But what if in their universe, nodding their head means they're hungry and they want to eat me? Well, well, I hope I just told them, uh, but please don't. I'm way too chewy. (laughs) Oh, communication can be tricky, folks. So be careful out there. Let's just have a little more music while I dig out my alien interference helmet. All right, we're talking superheroes, folks. What superpower would you choose? Do you see yourself scaling buildings, flying through the sky like a bomber, or telepathy? I'd be a shapeshifter. I could crash all the coolest parties and hang out with the beautiful people, and no one would ever know. Who would guess that napkin holder was little old me? (laughs) Better not disguise myself as a breadstick, of course. That would not be so cool. But I could be a virtual fly on the wall at all the significant events of our times. On second thought, not a fly. Our regular listeners know my feelings on spiders. Hi, listeners. Tony G here, coming from you from our new, revamped studio. Yes, folks, we've just completed our own mini-studio makeover. Very cool, very stylish. But it got me wondering... Have you ever noticed how everything is 50 shades of gray these days? Back in the early 1900, good old Henry Ford was telling motorists they could have any color car as long as it was black. Seems like the designer mafia has got the modern mandate all over our interiors. Any color as long as it's gray. How come color no longer is on trend? It's like permanent twilight, folks. Classy, but depressing, right? Here's some chill vibes to help us ponder the mysteries of style. Coming your way from coast to coast radio. (laughs) 